You ready? Are you ready? I'm ready. Oh, uh, you better be ready. I've been ready. I don't think you're ready. I am ready. What'd you say, Garrett? So I gotta lock my truck in bush. No, what'd you say before that? Um, our estimated arrival time is 12:11. Now that you're sitting here, it's gonna take us two hours and 34 minutes, and it is 140 miles. So you better get to driving. And it's 9:34, so we'll get there. We got a freaking long way to drive. We'll see you when we get there. Garrett, what are you doing? I gotta gain weight. He's gotta gain weight. For what? I'm going to the Air Force in July. No! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I got it. I say. Why would you choose this place? Jimmy Cleans Your is mirror's the already shit. out. Yeah, I know. Why would you choose this place? Jimmy Cleans is so much better. Look at what it just did to your window. That was already there. It just cracked your window. All right, guys, freaking big update. It's been about two hours since we last spoken, yeah. and we have been on nothing but highway, no, and we are no. finally turning off. How far till we get there? Uh, I don't know. My GPS is reset. What? I'm um, going to go. We're three minutes away. We'll be there at 1228. It is currently 1222. Oh, finally. It's freaking taking forever. We're taking the first road on the left. All right, guys, we are leaving his house. And we have them stacked into the back. Guess we're gonna come or go out the same way we came. Yep. Oh my gosh. Two hours, 33 minutes, and 183 miles. All right. Well, press start so I know where to freaking go. Go straight. Ooh, that's my jam. <laughs> oh my gosh. We just got home. Uh, Garrett done took off because he really had to pee apparently freaking almost six hours of driving that was it was over five and a half um yeah let's get these suckers out and let you guys get a better look at them all righty there's one of them great tread left these are mile king uh mud tracks uh 35s 22 inch wheels, hostile sprockets, chrome hostile sprockets, has a negative 44 offset, which is a lot more than those, 12 wides. I'm excited to put them on. Well, call Marty. I knew something wasn't right. I swear I saw a log nut. I was pulling over when that came off. My wheel is somewhere over there. Hey, you need to come down to the end of a uh, road, please. Uh, you just need to come down here. Fast. Like, pretty fast. Uh. Oh my god. I saw a lug nut come off. I was, I said, oh shit. So I pulled off. I was pulling off right there. Right freaking there. And it popped off right there. Oh my There's god. None of these lug nuts came off. I saw something shiny come off and I was pulling over to stop. Did he not? All these lug nuts are on. That was the only freaking wheel. That Your dad's probably hauling ass right now. Uh-huh. Ooh. Oh, shit. Look at this. Just dug in. Dude, I can't believe I was looking in the river. I was slowing down when it came off. Yeah, because you said, what's that? And all of a sudden, it what's flew, that? Turned yeah, into a blue off. Wheel flying into the tree. Maybe it'll help them hurry up and repave this road, though. I guess they've been putting it off for a year and a half, two I guess years. Guess dads aren't very good at putting lug nuts on, because my dad screwed me. But my wheel didn't fly off going 60 miles an hour. Dude, what in the hell? You hear that turbo? Yeah, you, you hear, hear the turbo? turbo? I hear that turbo. I hear that turbo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he has the work trailer on it too. Yeah. 
Did you tighten that down? Hell yeah, I tightened it down. You remember, you wiggled that wheel and something wasn't right about it. What in the hell? I tightened on that thing for... I saw a lug nut and I was slowing down yeah, when it came he, off. He was like, what's that? And I was like, what's what? And then all of a sudden, we start sliding from there. We slide all the way here. And Blowing the tire, smoke. The tire's tire tire way over there. The Hopefully it's not freaking busted. I don't know if it hit a tree. I was trying to get the camera out. Are those? That's all those, threads. Are the threads gone? Or are the threads there? The, the, they're all here. I mean, your lug nuts didn't hold. The lug nuts didn't Look hold? Look at the metal on there. Oh, yeah. That, the lug nuts just freaking gave up. I didn't tighten them 100%. We were going to go over to the church and do some turns to see if uh, it was going to scrub. We weren't increasing speed or anything. We were, we were slowing down because I saw something shiny come off, and I thought it came off my back wheel. And so I was slowing down, and then all of a sudden, the front end drops out, and then the wheel goes rolling alongside of us while we were going to a stop from like 30 miles an hour. Pray to God this wheel isn't messed up. It never got sideways. It never fell on the road. It might should be good. It's a lot of weight on it. Oh yeah. Until they actually popped off. Did you not feel it wobbling or anything? No, it wasn't wobbling. You counted the threads. We knew we got a good bite. How the hell are we gonna get this thing back home? I don't know, but I'm about to get me a damn thumbnail. <laughs> Kacha! I don't see any must that impact wrench don't tighten that tight. Uh-huh. It was plenty tight for you to drive down here and back. I saw one came off and I was about to slow down to make sure. I was thinking maybe one came off and so I was going to stop and check. All the threads are right there and there's no way that electric impact did that. Look at that. Well, they worked off. with your other tires. When we counted the threads, we knew that it was getting a good bite. And less six rotations of the lug nut. Is of the it possible nut? these things were damaged from here before you got them? Well, if you look on the back side, it doesn't see Even if they were damaged, it wouldn't have came off like that, would it? No, I don't think they're damaged. Did you get the wheel when it was... I was saying grab the camera while the wheel was in this guy's I was, yard. I was too busy watching it just bouncing going 40 miles an hour into a tree. Is there really any point in calling a tow truck for... No, we, we literally we went, went down the road. All right. <laughs> Everybody's saying, damn, Chevy should have bought a Ford. <laughs> At least they keep their fucking tires. Supposed to retorque them after 10 miles, bud. We didn't even Yeah, go, we didn't, we didn't, go, we didn't go, go 10 mile. miles. I love it how we've had at least 12 people pass by here and not a single person has asked if we're all right. Yeah, for real. Yeah. yeah just a tire popping off. No big deal. Yeah. <laughs> you didn't get that on video. Yeah, I got that on video. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking it happens. That definitely wasn't there before. Yeah, no, that was probably from bouncing in this right here. Yeah, these tires are in immaculate condition about two hours ago. <laughs> yeah, they're like brand new. Yeah. Honest truck. The you know the wheels that we just went and bought. Yeah. Hey. No Gotta love it, right? What happened? I, this <laughs> wheel fell off. Cruising That's down what happened. Road and it just oh, popped off. Shit. What'd you say? Uh, we don't know. Dad, his dad's on his way over here to get the trailer. Can you believe they didn't do that? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I was already holding on because Braden was like, I think a lug nut just fell off, and as soon as he said that, the tire, like, where? These are the tires y'all just put on? Yeah. These are the $3,000 tires.
find one? Yeah. Why is it way up here? The tire was already bouncing off. I really didn't think... Do what? Found, found, found one. one. Really didn't think that this morning when I woke up at 8.30 that we were going to be walking on the road looking for lug nuts. Mm -hmm. Alright, so we found the other lug nuts. They were actually in this guy's yard. Two were over there, two over there by the ditch. Uh, one, one right there and another over there. So apparently they All rather close to each other, so that means they that they must they, have held in the wheel when it was bouncing off. And then as soon as this big yeah, jumped the uh, jump the ditch that came out. You've seen me go through there so meticulously and get every single one of them perfectly pulled down a little here, a little there, a little there. Like the tire mm -hmm. store didn't run one all the way up and then the next one all the way up. I went round, 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 over and over and over. Well, there's no way you were going 45. You, that's like the ultimate break when you put the... I know. You I, must I, have been going 75, 80. No. There was no way. No way. Because I was probably doing close to 60 at the top of the hill and let off and was rolling. And then I started putting on the brakes right around here. And then it busted off and slid the entire way. So that's what you were doing while that's, we, we were almost we dying? Putting that's, my old wheels and tires on my four-wheeler? That's what he was doing. I was going to send you a picture and about the second that I was going to send you a picture. I called you? Yeah. You didn't even sound too worried. You were like, oh, all right. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. I didn't know what you was talking about. I couldn't imagine. I, I thought y'all done pissing me off because you done a donut or something. We could have handled that ourselves. Man, that's a pretty truck. <laughs> Send me the videos of your Snapchat and I might use them in the video. Whoa, whoa. What, what's going on? What's going on? Whoa, Gary, what's oh, going on? Let me, let me ask you what's going on, Mr. I can't even tighten lug nuts. Dang. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. There's only twelve, and we had eight. Most people wouldn't check for something like that. We checked for it and still done, done wrong somehow. Well, Braden, when I, we woke up at 8.30, I wasn't expecting our day to end like this. Hey, I think it was a pretty good day. Oh, it was a very successful day. Make YouTube videos. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I now, I now what, what, does, what comes first? Showing off my new wheels? <laughs> or me? I think you might as well just skip that and just jump to, jump to what actually happened. I wish I had my GoPro on. When, I wish I had the camera on. I know, dude. Would, it was, I was like, get the camera on, get the camera on. And I went and grabbed the camera. I just let go of the steering wheel because I couldn't steer. Yeah, there's no point in steering. I mean, maybe we're just going to go. I'm just lucky it didn't hit one of those person's mailboxes. It would have took a mailbox out. Where that tree? Because it would have been. Heavy freaking tires. It would have just tore up that wheel if it hit one of those trees.